Every two years, Manchester becomes even more of a cultural hub with the best one-off gigs, theatrical performances and art installations all across the city. We're here in Festival Square for Manchester International Festival 2017. Yeah, well, the amazing thing with Manchester International Festival compared to any other festival in the world is that it's all about creating new work. So virtually every single show that you're seeing is something that the day before didn't even exist. It's all about starting a conversation with the artist and asking them what they'd like to do and helping to develop that idea. When I came to sort of conceive of what it was that I wanted to do, I was thinking about the days when I was a wild little kid, you know, and we used to storm 200 miles up the M6 every weekend to, to go to the Hacienda, which of course is literally, or was, just down the road on Whitworth Street. And I felt, for me, those nights were so transformative. And I thought, I wonder how you can capture some of that energy, some of that magic, and kind of transpose it into something that would really resonate in the city. And yeah, that's what we've been trying to do with the Dark Matter series. Why should they come to the next one in 2019? Because it's brilliant. <laughs> when you walk in, you're going to get a completely different experience. And I think a lot of the work at the festival does have that effect, you know. But also come and see something that you've never heard of and, and take a risk. And, and of course, often it's that thing that you've never heard of that actually is the thing that blows your mind. I mean, it's all about the spirit of exploration and it's also, I guess, partly too about grounding the festival back into the streets of the city, which is why we had levels, <laughs> tearing it up on the opening night. Why has Manchester as well been chosen as like the sort of place to host all of this? Manchester chose itself. It's such an exciting time for the city. I feel it's a, a moment where the city really, really comes alive and there's all kinds of stuff that you can experience for free um, and all sorts of shows that I would never ordinarily see. I've been to a couple of the theatre productions which have completely blown me away. So the festival is really an opportunity to say to the world, yeah, we do brilliant cultural and artistic stuff in the city. On MCR Live.